many, many, many more. Amen. Amen. You can be seated. So please be patient with us. As Bishop said, we just have a few more things we want to, um, you can, you can give them. Um, we want to share, we captured some moments, Bishop. We captured some moments um, that we want to share with you. Um, several individuals give some one minute videos and at this time, we want to share those one-minute videos with you. this. Day. This is Grace from Canada and I celebrate you, I celebrate this day, I celebrate the great man that you are, I'm so grateful for your life, you, you have, you've impacted me in so many ways, I, I, I've seen my life going to a level of glory, a level of grace, a level of strength, just by watching you from afar, I've seen myself being trained, being changed by your ministry. So I celebrate your life. May the Lord bless you. May he lift you up. May you live very long in the power and the might and the strength of the Holy Ghost. May he lift you more and more in strength, impacting the lives of many people. I love you and I celebrate you. Happy birthday. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. So I have a way more than a thousand words to describe my gratitude for this man of God by the name of Bishop Robinson Von Dong. And the picture is what's on my chest. Yes, it says Steelers. But there's a message behind that. Because when I think of Bishop Von Dong, I think of a man that has faith as solid like steel. When I saw what you work out, what you demonstrated, what you manifested, the faith that you manifested because of what you heard in the pre-election, that showed me that this man of God has the faith of steel. Day. This is Grace from Canada and I celebrate you. I celebrate this day. I celebrate the great man that you are. I'm so grateful for your life. You, you have you've impacted me in so many ways. I, I, I've seen my life going to a level of glory, a level of grace, a level of strength. Just by watching you from afar, I've seen myself being trained, being changed by your ministry. So I celebrate your life. May the Lord bless you. May he lift you up. May you live very long in the power and the might and the strength of the Holy Ghost. May he lift you more and more in impacting the lives of many people. I love you. 
and I celebrate you. Happy birthday. They say a picture is worth a thousand words. So I have a way more than a thousand words to describe my gratitude for this man of God by the name of Bishop Robinson Von Bell. And the picture is what's on my chest. Yes, it says Steelers. But there's a message behind that. Because when I think of Bishop Vondam, I think of a man that has faith as solid life. When I saw what you worked out, what you demonstrated, what you manifested, the faith that you manifested because of what you heard in the pre-election, that showed me that this man of God has the faith of steel. Bishop, if you don't like my message, I like it myself. Love you, man. Mwah. <laughs> Happy birthday, Bishop. And we thank you. We thank you for being a blessing to us. Um, we, we, are, we are glad to be a part of this family. Uh, we know that you was a praying man, so we thank you to be in your presence. And uh, we I pray you have a, uh, another blessed year. Yeah, um, I'm thankful for your prayers, your boldness, you inspire me. Uh, I love you guys, and have a wonderful next year. All right. Bye. 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 Happy birthday, Bishop Fondon. It's Stephanie. I am so glad I get a chance to tell you happy birthday. You have been me up a spiritual leader, a spiritual father, a pastor. I am so grateful to God for sending me to you guys. I love you so much. I am praying for your new strength. I thank you for your tenacity. I thank you for leading us through. I thank you for being an example to all of us. Your faith moves mountains. Your faith moves mountains. I thank you so much for all that you do, all that you labor, your service, your, just your selflessness. I, I can't imagine all that you go through, but I thank you so much. Your labor is not a thing. You are touching millions of lives, and I'm so glad to be one of them. Have an amazing birthday century. Birthday century blessings, okay? From Stephanie. Love you much. I'll talk to you soon. Bye. Happy, happy, happy birthday, Bishop, our father, our mentor, our leader, our shepherd. You're such a wonderful shepherd that only the Lord knows how you, how you impacted some of us in our entire household. So we bless you this day, myself, my girls, and my entire household. We bless you with Revelation chapter 3 verse 8 and 2 Corinthians chapter 2 12. As you preach Christ, the gospel of Christ. Because you love him and you are crazy in love with him. May all those blessings be yours. May great perpetual doors be opened to you. For you have stepped into that realm. Hallelujah. May things come with their wealth, with their treasures to honor you. Hallelujah. Because of the Lord Jesus in you. May riches and wealth never depart from your house. May your generations be blessed. May your household be blessed above and beyond measure according to the purposes and treasure of heaven in jesus christ's name happy birthday love you much daddy happy birthday bishop we thank god for you and for the blessing you have been for us and for the people of god our prayer and our blessing for you is that the hand of the Lord should be upon you and that wherever you go, it should be known and manifest that the hand of the Lord is upon you. You be blessed when you're going out and coming in. God bless you with supernatural strength when you go to accomplish everything He's given you to accomplish. Happy birthday, Bishop. We love you. Amen. Happy birthday, Bishop Robinson. May the Lord God bless you and give you many more years. Happy birthday, Bishop Robinson, from Menashe, Noah. Hi, Bishop. This is the Jika's family. On this special day of your birthday, we just wanted to have this short video to say, Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Many more glorious days. Thank you for being such a blessing to the body of Christ and the 
Happy birthday, happy birthday. We love you. Many more glorious years in Jesus' name. Pastor, my family and I want to wish you happy birthday on this special day. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord be with you. May the Lord grant you his favor and the grace of the Lord dwell upon your life. Happy birthday, Pastor. We continue to bless you with good health. May the Lord bless you with long life. We are so happy that we are part of your life. May the Lord bless you with more hunger for God. May you seek God and find Him. May you hear from Him. May your children rise and call you blessed. You are a blessed pastor. We love you. You are the best pastor in the world. We are so happy we have the best pastor ever. Happy birthday, pastor. We happy love you. God bless you. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Bishop Robinson. May the Lord bless you. Bondum you and your entire family and the body of Christ in Maryland. This is Miguel Ferreira out of Miami, Florida. As, um, I am between churches. I've been blessed to be part of the body of Christ as a church and be minister by you every Sunday. Happy birthday. My personal, personal, personal bishop. I just want to wish you a happy birthday. Uh, on this day, we wish you long success, long life. May God give you the desire of your heart. And also just want to wish you uh, 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 many years to come. Uh, you are aging with grace. Thank you for everything that you do uh, to your spiritual children, to your family. You're such a role model. I can't thank you enough for the many advice that you have given me. Uh, thank you for being part of my life. You are such a blessing. And also, if you don't like my message, guess what? I like it myself. Just to know you is a great blessing. We appreciate you, mighty bishop, mighty apostle, mighty man of God. And we say, may God continue to bless your life and give you the best birthday you've ever had. In Jesus' name, amen. Happy birthday, happy birthday, Apostle Bishop Robinson von Dunn. The scripture I have for you comes from Job 32 verse 7. I thought age should speak and advanced years teach us wisdom. My friend, when uh, we begin to grow, when years are being added, you know what? Age should speak and advanced years should teach us wisdom so as your father i'm praying that god will begin to speak to you the lord will begin to speak to you the lord will begin to grant you extraordinary wisdom as you face your future as you go into your next level of your ministry that there shall be no procrastination and there shall be grace double grace and you shall move and operate in great favor and in great wisdom and great provisions from god i love you so much all the way from africa zambia happy birthday together with your family together CMFI online YouTube family. I want to wish you a blessed birthday and I want to thank God that you and your family and CMFI have come into our lives. You have been a blessing to us. We attend church every time there's church online and we even go back and look at the old ones just to get our messages in between and keep God as close as possible to us. We are so blessed to be a part of the CMFI family, and we it has brought us closer to Jesus. We want to attend one day in person. We hope to do that real soon. We love you and your message, and we're truly blessed to have CMFI as our church family. Again, have a blessed birthday, and we love you.
praise the Lord, Bishop. First of all, I have to say that the man God gave me wanted me to make it clear that this is a dealer's household. But nevertheless, the Lord did remind me that although detestable, he used a raven to feed Elijah. So today, I give thanks to the Lord. I thank God for sending you to feed me. I can truly say that I am well fed. And on your special day, I just wanted to say, may you have a very, very, very happy birthday. And many, many, many more years of God. Amen. See if you can just give us about five more minutes. Um, I was asked to to share one verse um, by Pastor Jay and Dr. Liz that sort of captures our bishop. And the verse that came to mind was uh, 2 Timothy 4, 2. It says, preach the word. Be instant in season and out of season. Hasn't Bishop been instant in season and out of season? If there was ever a person, if you have any doubt that he is a man that is preaching the word in season, And out of season. I don't think we have any doubt. But this morning the Lord woke me up. And he said read the verse before that. And that really blessed me. To the point where the worship team will be singing the blessing. Which I truly believe is fitting, Bishop. I have to confess, I've never looked at verse 1 before. It's been 20 plus years I've been in ministry and I've always gone straight to the second verse because my pastor put that in me. Son, all you have to do is just preach the word. Be instant in season and out of season. But verse 1 says, I charge thee therefore before God. I charge thee, Bishop Robinson Fondon, before God and the Lord Jesus Christ. Who shall do what? Judge the quick and the dead. And so I looked up the word quick. Blew me away. The word quick, church, typifies a bishop the word quick means someone who trembles at his word you see the word word in verse 2 is logos but the word word in verse 1 is rhema Jesus is coming back And he's looking for man and woman of God who are what? Quick. We're not going to go there, but, but Isaiah 66 verse 5 says he's coming for those who will hear and tremble at his word. See, the reason why this song that we're about to sing is so critical, Bishop. Because Psalms 1 says, The blessed man, he shall be like a tree. Planted by what? The rivers of water. And that phrase, rivers of water, guess what it means? Quick. It's the same meaning. 
So whereas we, we are like trees, Bishop. We are like trees. And we are planted by that rivers of water. And one of the things that the Lord said to me during this time and during this new season, it's time that we all, that we all step on board. You see, there are some that don't necessarily agree with you. Bishop, I don't agree with everything that comes out of you. But guess what? You are the sent one. And it's not about me agreeing. It's not about me agreeing. It's about me standing in the rivers of living water. The man that is quick. To heed the voice of God. God never said in Psalms 1 or 2 Timothy 4 to align yourselves with someone that you agree a hundred percent. And so for those that may be stepping aside, Bishop, because they may not necessarily agree a hundred percent, the Lord is saying they're, they're missing their blessing. And God has sent you as the blessing. He has sent us as the trees. We are planted in that rivers. And Bishop Fondong, you are the river of living water, of running water. That's what Jesus is coming back. He's coming back to the church. And he's looking at the church as the last time I say, he's looking at the church and he say, okay, I'm looking for a church. Either they're quick or they're dead. And so because God has sent us a man of God who unapologetically preaches the word, in season and out of season. But it began in verse 1. Because you hear the voice of God. The Lord bless you and keep you. Make his face shine upon you. And be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. Amen. He's for you, he's for you, he's for 
and our online congregation we want to present to you a happy birthday gift of all nations hallelujah. and it has the map of the nations on the cake hallelujah god bless you praise the lord yes. wow my first question is bishop did you guess this one i don't know if you guessed it there has been work put in to make this a surprise but we thank god that you went to cameroon you can be seated please we'll, we'll, we'll take the yes we can take it we'll cut it and we'll enjoy it after service Hallelujah. We thank, thank God, even though your, let's reduce, please. Um, even though your birthday is tomorrow, uh, it, it just fell on the right time. You were out for a Sunday. And then uh, you just have a short time to prepare this. I, yeah, this, this. let's just re reduce the, the monitors, maybe. So I uh, would just like to thank everyone who participated. I know 
even I did not have time to have a video there. I know it was just a short time. So thank, thank everyone who gave online. I mean, there was a marathon of giving. And I just want to say that we accomplished our goals for those who, for, for those who understood that. <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. So some of it was for the gift and some of it is going to be cash directed to him. And I'm sure because we are a church of abundance, we, we, we shall exceed that, that our goal. Amen. We'd like to thank Dr. Elizabeth for giving us the secret of the gift. Hallelujah. Uh, we, we pray that uh, with, with, with that iPad, you'll be able to write books. Hallelujah. We thank God for those who gave online, the online church. Amen. I call uh, Stephanie the captain of the online church. Hallelujah. She, I think the idea was birthed through her and then we, we just ran with it. Uh, the online church was so involved. Thank you so much for donating as well. Josiah was the, the editor of the video, you know, making sure that everybody was sending. I actually even got videos this morning. So some of them didn't make it. So uh, Bishop will, will see the videos for sure. But sorry that he was not on time for it uh, to see it, um, uh, to share it online. We thank the worship team for being involved. Uh, the, some of the people on the, the birthday committee, there was a committee bishop. Can you believe this? It was, it was, it was serious. Uh, we just thank Brother Clement, Brother Freddy, Brother JC, Dr. Ray, Sister Excellence, uh, to Mama Annie, Brother Zach, Steve, and Brother Nelo.